And we're live, and it started off with me burping at people. As usual. Yeah. The whole two people watching, one of them is probably me. <laughs> Welcome, everyone. And we've got to do the Hanover mission again. We've been sent back because we were shit. <laughs> I'll do that again. But I printed out the map with the waypoint markers on it. I printed out the map with the flak zones on it. Although the quality of them is quite bad. So it's basically impossible for me to want to actually see what it says on them. Guess you're gay. Hey, it's your fault for bringing me really shitty quality uh I have to restart Ah, fishy is gone. Still all by myself. Lately, my track IR keeps crashing on uh, launch, and I then have to close some random program so that it works again. Oh. This time it was Chrome. Just tried Steam Discord, and yeah, Chrome. <laughs> Stupid fucking game. Stupid. Um, I pay. And he had doxed. <laughs> huh. What? Huh. What, huh? Let me know when it's ready to go. Huh. Oh, wish I made some coffee. I'm gonna do that quickly, actually. I'm gonna make some coffee. I made a big mistake as well. I need to quit my game quickly. I accidentally disconnected one of my my joysticks so I can charge my headphones because I'm a wireless pleb. Huh. Well, I love wireless. And how much charge has got left? <laughs> we'll find out. <laughs> And I've turned the brightness up of the stream a little bit more, so everyone will be able to see what's going on, which will be all good. Right, I'm going to go make a coffee. Let me know when it's up. It's up. Oh, boy. I spent for like 45 minutes. Well, I can't join it. Did you take DIP and TeamSpeak? Yeah. Well, nothing has changed since yesterday. Just please wait. Uh. This one? No, not that one. That's a new one. Okay, so you did not notice that I told you that I gave you admin rights on TeamSpeak so you can check my IP. Oh, no, I did not. I probably wasn't here when you said that. You were! Nah. <laughs> just weren't listening, you were talking. Divorce. Oh yeah, I'm according to uh, Fishy's TeamSpeak, I, TeamSpeak, Discord, I'm your wife now. Which is pretty funny. Yeah, that somebody went like, what, Fishy has a wife? Fishy has a wife. I know, what it's, the fuck? it's me. <laughs> <laughs> His man wife. I, I I first didn't understand what he meant, like, eh? and then what oh, you because mean? of the divorce screenshot. <laughs> I, I then just wrote, "Yes, Krabby is my wife." It was pretty great. I even bothered to change thumbnail to a different Lancaster 
all, all that I've noticed with the Lancaster like art paintings is the ground is just fire. So apparently Germany is just on fire when a Lancaster flies over the top. I think the further the war was, uh, the, more the better they were storm. at setting firestorms. <laughs> yeah, because what, what are we carrying? Bombs. Why aren't we carrying incendiaries? Uh. Because go fuck yourself, you fucking hunt. I want incendiaries. I, although I do remember incendiaries, at least in YPAC, causes the game to pretty much play at a slideshow pace. Yeah. Whoever modded the Halifax had the bright idea to add incendiaries. You have a loadout that says like 1,260 incendiaries. <laughs> yeah, guess what happens when you when like four aircraft drop us at a time. Yeah. Two FPS. Yay! We love also, that. Also, the British used to drop HE first and then incendiaries, so the roofs were off. Yeah. My favorite bomb, the bat bomb. I don't know. Actually, I don't know if that was a thing. I think it was an idea. I think there are some aircraft with which you can choose. It was what was it? The bat bomb. Yeah. What was it? Uh, I don't know. It's it kind of weird. I think they used bats to carry basically incendiary, and they'd fly around and they'd nest. Or they'd like try and hide in like a Japanese house, and then that because the houses are basically made out of paper, they would burn. Oh, it was one of those glorious ideas that it, that did not work. Yeah. <laughs> like the uh, Russian anti-tank dogs, which then of course ran to their own own tanks because they were trained with with their own tanks. Yeah. Glorious. Glorious ideas. All right, I'm ready. All right. Tits, 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 tits. I'm um, done. <laughs> okay, starting and recording. Alright, three, two, one, bam. And lights. On, off. Okay. Here we go, boys. Again. <laughs> uh, where's my watch? You'll need that. Where did I put it? Stupid fish! Where is it? <laughs> oh, there it is. Sixteen forty-five. Come on, three. Oh, I'm starting four instead. Hello, dear viewer. Krabby has a German spy on board. It's me. <laughs> I've not put you through the radio thing today. I can't be bothered. Honestly, we have tried to have all, an all-British crew. We had, let's say, technical difficulties. Mm. The technical difficulties being them. <laughs> Sadly. One did been... not find the server. One installed some BAT add on in the wrong order and had a bugged Lancaster. And the other one couldn't get Reshade to work. 
Would have been nice to have an old British crew, maybe in the future. To Helen back, we I'd still like to have a few crew members that want to take part. Still does not work at Stockfire. Yeah, not in the co pilot thing, but. Oh no, they're not going any of the things. Correct. Nah. Well, what version of that will be? What will we be doing that on? 4.12.2 fishy version. Ah, easy. That's the version I've still kept, but yet not touched in like a year. <laughs> yeah, we've only been using it for that specific purpose, really. Since I did make some formations completely manually, I noticed that those work even better than the 412 connected ones, so I tend to use those. Didn't you not catch that corner last time as well? <laughs> yeah, it's just practically quite hard. <laughs> it's fine. The taxiing is but a little part of the video. That is true, but the beginning is important. Mate, I can tell you living in England, the grass is as fine as any. <laughs> It's not grass, it's lawn. <laughs> so that means it's even better. Yeah. Wish we had night vision. Lawn is the cultivated version, you know, where somebody takes care of it. my flaps down just so they're ready to go and I'm not flying with the um, curtain down today because uh, yesterday I became a hermit <laughs> that does not sound like a very good idea Please break. Please break. Please break. <laughs> the brakes are very bad on this thing. Buckle up. Tail wheel locked. A little left-handed here, buddy. That's all right. Hammer up.
getting really good at flying this thing. <laughs> you, you, there's nothing better than the feeling, well, there's lots of good feelings, um, than like learning an aircraft. Could always get drunk. True. <laughs> <laughs> Climbing, climbing, climbing. You remember 081, although probably does not matter since you're gonna follow the others, right? Yeah, we'll follow the begin for others to begin with. And then undoubtedly we end up splitting up towards the end. And we're out of the turbulence. How hard is this? Is was this mission to make? Was it quite difficult, or is it like easier than a Helen back style thing where you have to time everything to each other? If that makes sense. Timing this is pretty easy, I just had to make sure that the night fighters are in the... that they fly into the bomber stream. Yeah. That was not hard at all. But the main problem with this is that making 100 bombers do the whole trip is a lot of repetition. Yeah. And a lot of work because you want to split up the altitudes, because if they are all at the same altitude they are going to crash into each other. So you all the time go like, okay, this one flies at 5,010 meters, make all the waypoints. <laughs> this one, 5,020 meters, make all the waypoints. I, I did, uh, checked yesterday, this mission actually contains over 2,000 waypoints. Is that bomber passing us on the left? The hard part was to get the AI to work. Yeah. At, at all, it's still not, not perfect, but at least the German night fighters has to engage. Yeah. Like, it, it took days and days of work to find out that the cloud height is responsible for the AI not attacking. Like, what the heck? <laughs> In good weather, like, all 30 kilometers is a small puff of smoke or cloud, whatever. And the, the AI it behaves completely different when you put those at a different altitude. <laughs> Aha! It, that, that were really, really frustrating days because I saw that the AI attacked in a different mission. I just went, okay, cool, let's make a full mission then, if it works. And then while testing, the Germans just did zero kills. They all did that stupid stuff where they saw a bomber, then nose dive like two kilometers down, and then did that left, right, left, right, left, yeah. right, left, right, for like 35 minutes and then flew home. <laughs> And, and I'm like, what the heck? What the hell? <laughs> uh, we've got yeah, Bomber on the right then, side. And then you check your Raza mission, and you see that the, the mosquitoes just attack. And then, okay, is it maybe because it's British AI? I then took the mission, changed every uh, RAF aircraft to RAF post-war, which is then on the blue side. <laughs> like NATO is then blue, you know, and yeah. Russia is still red. And Germans all to uh, German, to uh, I think DDR, like East Germany. Yeah. Or something. Same result. AI does not engage. Like, okay, that's not it. Next. <laughs> Change the AI, AI all to A's. Maybe they, they can see better. None engaged. Change the armament, fuel loadout. Made some fly at a different altitude. Engaged. And then, like, <sighs> yeah, we went, went back to the other mission, saw outs at like 2,500 meters, and the German bombers flew at 4,000. Yeah. And so they often even passed through the clouds. And I went, like, huh, okay. 
yeah, change the cloud altitude to 3000 or something in this mission. Et voila! <laughs> My connection is taking a massive dump right now. Great. Well, I shouldn't disconnect at all, but kind of annoying. Got a bomber on our right side, it's just overtaking us. I just hate the eliminations that IL-2 has. Yeah. I would have loved bad weather. Because with the BAT cloud mods, that looks pretty awesome. Yeah. And the clouds are very big then, and you really can't see much. Also, it's very atmospheric when you pass through, and then you see the other, other bombers against the clouds and so on. Uh, but searchlights, searchlights, lights just won't show up. Whether zero and one, searchlights work. Whether two or worse, searchlights lights don't. At least, at least if you are above a cloud, there does not have to be a cloud actually in the way. But the AI just goes, "There's a cloud. I can't see anything." Yeah, oh, I think Hannah is uploading her work and it's like four gigs of stuff <laughs> fuck's sake so the live stream is down at the moment as well as my internet being terrible okay so uh, project cancelled because you're gonna have a laggy replay and shit huh project cancelled because replay is gonna be shit mm. hyping and stuff <sighs> should be alright Still climbing. Just hit 7,000 feet. Then I tried to put some aircraft below the boats so that the searchlights would at least go go on. And then I put a command and control dead zone object, uh, uh, not dead, dead zone, a box object so that there is flag. And of course, it uh, pretty much only shoots at the one below the clouds. Yeah. It lights up the whole ground and stuff. So that didn't work at all. That's why we now fly in good weather, which is the worst weather condition in which the lights actually do something. <laughs> because that's how it was. Hey, there is a cloud. Yeah, no point at li at using the in using the searchlights. Right. Let's just go. No, no, not not do it. <laughs> Don't worry about it. I have two developers. I hate them. <laughs> whoever whoever made that change, it's so stupid. That's the same way with flag. When you have aircraft flying over the clouds, like a whole combat wing with 50 bombers, it's weather four or worse. Flag doesn't fire. Nope. I don't see any bomber. Nah, the but the shells might like might might land somewhere else. <laughs> I have heard of incidents where there wasn't even any enemy bomber over the city. Still, the flag fired a few thousand shells. Because they heard engine noises of their own night fighters. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and they sometimes even would just fire just to calm the, the people in the city. Like, yeah. we're doing something, don't worry. Yeah. It's like so much stuff in IL2, it's just poorly made. Really, really poorly. <laughs> Still flying up. So, what do you reckon our chances of survival are this time? Less than half? <laughs> Hard to tell. Last time it was like 66%, right? Because of 110, like, well, 120, like 40 were shot down. Yeah. If you just go by deaths, I think like a third. <laughs> but 
our survival chance is of course higher because we are not a stupid AI Lancaster that just keeps flying straight, we're gonna evade. <laughs> you what? Beep boop. <laughs> Should not be too bad. I made it to, in a way that after the target more Lancaster has went in. Oh really? There are no... Yeah. God damn cheater. And, and, the, and the battle now goes on until we are back over the North Sea. Yeah, but you're gonna, you've ruined the video now for everyone. <laughs> Easy peasy. You will write a script and we will re replace our audio... A script with for four hours. Acting. Nah, mate. Brits. <laughs> well, we don't have to... We, you, the crew doesn't have to talk much, you know. We speed. Also, I did check, and yeah, we should be pretty much in front of this bomber stream. Yeah. Well, I was flying as I was instructed, and if we're at the front, doing what we're it's supposed fine. to do, I then it makes sense. In a way that's totally fine. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but if we could not get shot at again, that'd, that'd be great. <laughs> I, just had, I just have made so many missions lately, and uh, videos and stuff. I just couldn't remember for the life of me <laughs> the, where the ex exact position in the bomber stream was. <laughs> I have a splinter in my sock and I can't figure out where it is. I'm going AFK with a new pair of socks. This is annoying. <laughs> <laughs> Be right back. Lagging a little bit. Due to someone uploading stuff. doing this every night. Every night. Most nights since we do 35 missions. You bloody hell. I am back. Welcome. 12,000 feet. Across the coast at yep. 5 p.m. and around 4 minutes. The water looks nicer. <laughs> Yeah, things are a little bit oh. laggy because uh, they're uploading, but it'll be done in 10 minutes, so that's okay. I really don't I like the idea of having a laggy recording. <laughs> well, this is all. This is the only time I have today. It depends whether you want to call it off now or we fly the whole thing. <laughs> I have nothing better to do. <laughs> Purchased 54 beers today, otherwise... Of course I could start using any other video. <laughs> <laughs> well, how bad is it? Are the like morphing front and back like hell or...? Not like mad, just like the tiniest amount. Okay. Like it's one of those things, if you're looking out for it, you'll see it, but in, if you're not, it's not really immersion breaking in any way. In that case, shut up. <laughs> Don't get any attention on it. <laughs> I 
We're climbing. 14,000 feet nearly. 220 miles per hour. I think I, I think I will make this mission the other way around. Like we are going to take off in darkness and we'll come back in, in the morning. Yeah. You're supposed to have it where you take off just before sundown. You make the mission long enough that we come back just before sunset. <laughs> as the sun comes up it in might, the morning. It might, it might work in a summer mission. Yeah. Like those days when it's when it gets dark at uh, 10 p.m. my time. Yeah. And gets the sun comes up at 4 a.m. If we go to Berlin or something, yeah. Yeah. The longer mission. I mean, with spawning a new aircraft, probably make a super epic mission. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And like the British losing 52. 60, 70 bombers, a mission happened regularly. Yeah. So. And over a hundred at Nuremberg. One can only change their heads to that, right? Like. It's fine because night bombing works. <laughs> We are definitely at the pointy end of the stream, aren't we? It's only four bombers, five bombers I can see in front of us. How many did you overtake? Uh, just the one. One, two, three, four, I see five in front of us. Yeah. We've got one at uh, 11. We've got the other stream coming on our left side. Good six, yeah. Seven on the left. Give it some more power. Just hit, just gone past 16,300 feet. Almost there. And the guy Roger next to us is leveled off. We're going to carry going up. Your wings aren't quite level, I think. Yeah, I'm uh, going a bit to the right. Pretty much on course, though. Yeah, the trim... Oh God, the fucking trim on this aircraft makes me want to end... everything. <laughs> it's just so bad. Little pixels in the background. Hit 17,000. Thousand five hundred.
leveling off around 18,000 feet. Okie dokie, skipper. Still climbing, stop climbing. <laughs> stop this. There are bombers coming in, in from 3 o'clock as well. Seen. Around about five minutes until we are scheduled to reach the 091 waypoint. Watch out. Just hit 245 miles per hour. Still got bombers in front. It's all good. Many close behind us. All yep. perfect. Ah, time for the immersion again. <laughs> I can't wait. And I've got my little map telling me the waypoints. It's almost at two, yeah? Yep. 7673, I don't know what that means. <laughs> or is that 1613? I don't know what that's. It's really badly printed out, right? <laughs> Can't really tell what it it's, says. It says 1719. Alright. Then the yeah, next. I would have liked to make this in a way bigger resolution, but if I. like make the image ten times bigger so you have all the detail your computer just dies when you want to open it it's fine like, uh, <laughs> I want it <laughs> like 15,000 at 10,000 not a good idea also if you then just uh, press print it's gonna <laughs> be multiple uh, square meters <laughs> <laughs> of course you can still print a higher resolution one, smaller, but you know what I mean. Hmm. I I think I'm I should make myself such a wall, just with, with such a curtain, and when people come, well, what's behind the curtain? Mission for today. Yeah. <laughs> you just sit them down. He's like, thank you for turning up, and this is your mission. <laughs> and they all sat there with their coffee, like, what the fuck? <laughs> Want us to what? <laughs> Berlin? <laughs> Little specks to the left. Wrong course. Seems darker than yesterday. Of course. Your curtains are open, right? Yes. Oh, then I'll be a hermit again. I don't want to be a hermit. 
<laughs> I think I might have to. Struggling to see. Hermit time. I've officially hermited. Yeah, well, while doing this, you kinda just have to admit that you're nerding around. Yes. <laughs> now there's a whole bunch of. Uh, there's a uh, whole bunch two, of. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, We're going 255 now. Roger. Waypoint should be reached very soon. Roger. I think turn to zero nine one the cloud. Yep. Looks like the other ones are turning to the right there. You'll do that. Got a speedy one, eleven o'clock low. Yeah. Guess somebody has to go first. Yep. <laughs> Good luck, guys. And he wants to be the first one. Imagine you want to be the first one or the last one in the bomber stream. You don't want to be in the middle of it all. I think being in the very front or in the very rear is bad because if you have any night fighter approaching from the front or the rear, you're going to be the closest contact. Yep. Zero nine one. Correct. After thirty five minutes. Nice. Seventeen twenty. Turn to zero nine one. One hundred and fifteen kilometers until coast. Nice. That should be about seventeen minutes. Yeah, bombs are still in front of us as well. Yeah, having the time when we are above the coast is kind of a, an important navigational point. Yes. For the next waypoint. The other ones, until now, were pre pretty uh, uh, unimportant.
yesterday I watched video that Greg uploaded Greg's automobiles and airplanes. Yeah. About the ME one six three. And goddamn that thing is horrifying. Yes. Like um, a sentence came came up like and they checked the pilot but they had to see that the tea stuff had dissolved the pilot. <laughs> Christ. That I'm like I'm, I'm like okay. In my head, that looks like that heavy metal scene where the astronaut just fag gone. And I was like, define dissolve. <laughs> just no bones, no nothing, just a soup in the bottom. That's what comes to mind, right? Yeah. And I mean, what the f what the heck? <laughs> Uh, apparently they put they had to put the tanks with that stuff around the pilot because of uh, weight balance issues so when you crashed and uh, one of the fuel lines broke and went into the cockpit you were apparently dissolved oh, I, mean, I, I, I just like Jesus Christ oh. I'd rather explode you know it was almost more dangerous to be the pilot than it was to be anyone else <laughs> I think, like, couldn't you just have flown those into a formation? Eject and press the e explode button? Yeah. Yeah, put an ejection seat in, fly into the formation, eject, and then... Uh, have, like... How do you call it? A remote control to explode the thing? Oh, yeah, yeah. On trim. <laughs> so bad. Have you ever tried to like throttle back a bit on one side, like a percent or so? Hmm. If you just can't hit the middle. Still seeing bombers ahead. They've just come up against that cloud, so still on track. Yeah, I wouldn't worry about it at the moment. It's perfect. Last time it felt like we weren't close to like any bombers at all, but this time they've got quite a lot of them below us. To our like 11 o'clock low, 10 o'clock low. I'd say you can pretty much relax at the moment. Yeah. Just of 18,000 feet. And that slight right cor correction is like... Uh, 30 minutes away, so... Yeah. The long fly... Scheduled for 1834. Correction, 1841. Uh, 31. Correction of the correction. Next waypoint <laughs> is scheduled for 1831. <laughs> Above the yellow marker flares. Or the orange ones? Orange ones. Yeah. Seeing that on my map here. <laughs> Coast should come up in five minutes. Hold on to your hats.
I even am wearing a hat. Oh. Like a baseball cap for oh, the no. <laughs> I am not. I'll be wearing a bike helmet later. I've decided I'm gonna cycle to the gym and be good. Instead of like bus it or car it, because that makes little sense. <laughs> That way you also could just uh, use a, uh, a gym that is very far away and just cycle all the way and... and yeah. Running pretty steadily. Trim's a little bit to the left, but... It's uh, pretty stable right now, so I'm just going to deal with it as it is. Sounds like typical mod bullshit that you can either move a bit to the right or to the left. It's because never it's right. <laughs> because streaming straight is overrated. Yeah. Trimming in video games is so difficult. In real life, it's so easy. I wonder how much speed it costs a bomber if you just misalign all the turrets. <laughs> like everybody look left and right. Everyone look to the left. Uh. And if that's noticeable, if everybody looks to the left, or, or like the guns are all on one side, if you <laughs> notice the drag on one side. Isn't it like the way that when people move around in the aircraft that you notice? Um, I don't think you would so much. I think if you have like five passengers who all sit in the front and they suddenly move, move to the, to the yeah, back. Yeah, 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 that would make a huge difference. I was reading, yeah. oh, I don't know whose book I was reading. I think it was a John Comer one that I insistently read all the time, just because it's fantastic. Um, they started off one mission and their, the rest of the crew forgot to tell the pilots that they had stocked up the plane with more ammunition, but they didn't stock it up in the radio room, they put the extra ammunition in all the positions, which meant the tail also had like another 2,000 rounds in it, which almost caused them to crash into the trees at the end of the runway. And when he found out, he just he ran he kind of like ran to the back of the plane and hit him across the head and said, "Don't you ever fucking do that again!" And then went back. <laughs> Hold on for a second here. Pilot stands up, runs to the back of the plane. <laughs> and he was the um, top turret gunner. And there's another one as well where they were having issues with um, oxygen because and it's the uh, because it's the engineer's job to keep the aircraft level. Yeah. Balanced. It, it was, um... They were having problems with their uh, oxygen system. This was like his 20th to 25th mission. I can't remember which one this was, but this was near the end. And he got put on... Uh, I don't know if it was a different crew or whether the, his crew was split up. But his rear gunner was a Polish guy. Um, who had come over and he kind of got drafted in... You know, he wanted to fight and he ended up becoming part of the US Air Force. And um, he went out to go check on his oxygen system because they hadn't heard of him for a, while, for a while. So they went back to go check on him. He was passed out cold. So he put him on his oxygen while he kind of like tried to break the ice in the lines. And once the Polish guy, once as soon as the Polish guy woke up, 
he like instinctively punched the guy in the face. <laughs> so he woke up and the Polish guy punched John in the face. And then John's there like, Whoa, what the fuck is going on here? And he's <laughs> all whilst they're under attack as well. <laughs> so That's he's there. interesting when you read the notes of, of Cruz. They always have stories like that. <laughs> always something went wrong. Okay, I can't see the coast. You can. Where is it? Oh, you say you can't. I can't. Ah, cool. No, I can to the. I can to three o'clock. Yeah, I can to the left as well. There's um, ten o'clock. I see the coast. Yeah, it's coming up now. Can you make out when we are above it? Uh, hopefully. <laughs> we'll find out. I can kind of see it when I'm in a cloud, because I L2. <laughs> yeah. I noticed as well. Well, already when I'm in the front gun, it's pretty much black. Yeah, it's pretty dark over here. The sun's still out behind us, so... Sadly, we still cannot see you. Yeah, everything is a touch brighter in the back, for some reason. To uh, friendly bombers to our 11 o'clock low, so we're definitely in it. <laughs> yep. Don't know if there's anyone to our right. Right, I think the coast is near this cloud, like just over the other side. Since the coast is like going northeast, it's further away, the further you are from Britain. I can see it to the right, but we're still not above it. Yeah. Veteran memoirs are always awesome. They all have stories like that. Hmm. Searchlights, 12 o'clock. I see that. Must be pretty close to the coast by now. Yep. Well, my calculation said that we should above it after 17 minutes of, of the waypoint. And we will be like in 30 seconds, I think. Yeah, these third are on the coast, aren't they? Yeah. It's Rotterdam. Yeah, I can't see. I would have to assume and say that we're nearly over them. Might have to go by your timing on this one. 
Yeah, I'm gonna mark over coast now. Seventeen thirty two. Marshmallows being let up. Searchlight ten hook. A hundred and twenty five kilometers until next waypoint. Yeah. Black twelve low. Round about eighteen minutes. I will let you know. Roger. Try and get past this flak first. Don't shy away from evasive action. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that if we uh, get into that. Fastest way to get out of a flak zone is to just fly fast. <laughs> Well, technically the fastest way is to oh dive. God. So you're, st you're faster than full power. <laughs> Hello? Mike yeah, back. Mike off. I'm back. Welcome back. What did you say last? Kind of an unopportune moment to go AFK, to be honest. <laughs> I was still here, but I was talking to someone else. I see. Black still 12 low. Bomber going down, 5 o'clock. Oh, crikey. I see something moving left to right in front of us. Might have been a bomber that's been hit. Was that close flak or was that machine gun fire? I, I have heard... seen neither. I thought I heard gunfire. That was weird. Like really faintly. Like 10 o'clock low. It's unlucky to get shot down while to the coast. Yeah, did we get that far? Do 
Looks like we made it unharmed. Yeah. There was a couple of close flag hits, but I say close, they were. Didn't make the plane shudder, but I heard them. <laughs> Lots of bombers uh, to our left there. Oh, flag's still going. One bomber has really slowed down there on uh, just coming to our nine o'clock. Might have had a hit engine or something. No visual. He's the last one of the three. He's coming to my wing now on the left side. Looks fine for, for me. Uh, he's you much mean, slower than the other guys. You mean the one at nine o'clock low? Yeah. There's three of them. He's the last one. Much slower than the rest of us. We are coming up on one hour of recording, enabling autopilots. Roger. Three, two, one, refresh. Turn lights. Lights, please. On, off. Got it. Ah. My... Ah! The, um... Console won't go away. Shift tab. Yeah, I'm doing that. Ah, there we go. Uh, if that happens again, type POD enter. It just wouldn't go away for ages. <laughs> Christ. If that happens again, type TOD enter. Yeah, TOD enter. TOD. Oh, TOD. That's a command that doesn't do much, it just tells you the mission time. <laughs> time of day, you know. Next waypoint scheduled in 11 minutes. Roger that, navigator. <laughs> Tally ho, boobity bib. That bomb was quite close to us actually, it's uh, 9 o'clock low. Current heading zero nine six.
It's so dark, it feels like everything I'm doing is at a standstill. It doesn't feel like I'm going anywhere. It just feels like I'm in the same place. Yeah, I'm still in the cockpit. It's pretty weird, isn't it? But don't the clouds move? Yeah, but it's like... They don't really feel like it until you get really close. Okay. Trim work, you bastard. Someone just turned a light off. Is this eye racing day night cycle? <laughs> How much longer till waypoint? About ten minutes. Eight minutes. Watch out. That's... is that a coloured one? Yep. Oh, that's orange. Correct. See, I know where we are now, because I'll put it on the map. <laughs> and I meant to say like seven minutes, not eight. Watch out. Uh, I just saw flares, 12 o'clock, orange flares. Right on time. That's our waypoint. Roger. Turn to 095 while above them. Do you want to go over them? Do you want to go 095? Over them. Roger. I wish those were performance light. I would put them everywhere <laughs> and make different color codes and stuff because that's what they did in reality. It was yeah. not like every time yellow is the waypoint, but they changed that all the time and they had fake ones and stuff. So the Germans would think, ah, oh, they have flares dropped over that city. That must be the target. No, nope, it's just a yeah, just put them everywhere. Yeah. Then I want to be back in England telling the German night fighters that in fact we're over here when the German night fire, the GCI over in Germany are like, what are you doing? <laughs> <Yep. laughs> Must have been very funny when those had like arguments over the radio <laughs> and you just sit in your cockpit like, hmm. Two GCI controllers from different countries fighting a war by shouting at each other. <laughs> it's pretty keck. <laughs> it's so dark.
the losses in like collisions must have been horrific alone in the Lancaster or Halifax or that's a negative it's not like four aircraft per night or so huh. they attacked in different waves later and uh, each wave had uh, set altitude so there would not be any collisions in between waves for example yeah there was a lot of organizational stuff going on uh, let me know when we're over that flare will do still got the uh, lankies to our left side so doing well Did you take Shark of the Sky again? Huh? Did you yes, take yes, Shark? Yes, yes, yes. Okay. I, I did make sure before we did, before we did it. That would be pretty bad. That would be a darky move to make, wouldn't it? Ah, uh, I recently picked wrong skins too. Uh, sounds like there's no fires around. Rise peeled. Waypoint reached nineteen fifty seven. New course zero nine five. Zero nine five. Barely a turn. There we go. <laughs> Yeah, but you, if you go five degrees in a different direction over half an hour... Yeah, it's still quite a fair distance, isn't it? Yep. It's the motherfucking DOWG speed. <laughs> About 32 minutes until the next waypoint. And I haven't seen any trace of fire yet. I feel like we're very much on our own now. There's a Lanky over Lancaster over to our half 10, nearly co alt. But that's about it. I assume there's more around, but I can't see him. 
Next flares being dropped. No ice. Right behind us. Oh, is it for the the guys behind? Yeah. I can hear an aircraft very close. Don't see it though. Might be the Lancaster to our left. There are multiple around, definitely. So don't worry. Yeah. Have to be very vigilant. And now there is tracer fire at five o'clock. Roger. And so it begins. I also find it mad that the Lancaster only had one pilot. I mean, I knew that for a while, but like, sitting here and doing this yesterday with a, with a mission that's kind of like half the distance is what they would have done. Uh, <laughs> big no. <laughs> yeah, one really has to think, why? I think everything that was done with Britain at the time, or even before that, it was like we have. To, if we're going to fight another war, we had to do it with as little manpower as possible. Even if that means cutting down another pilot, another gunner, that kind of shit. Huh? Like people in Britain were still so mad about the First World War. No one wanted to join up and do the second one. There's that whole like, oh yeah, but we fought in the war and, you know, people that didn't fight in war <laughs> like to tell you that we joined up because we wanted to fight the ton and whatever, but it wasn't really true. <laughs> in the First World War, yeah, but not this one. Tracer, 12 o'clock. How did one become a bomber pilot? Volunteer? Yeah, I think so. Great. <laughs> More trace as well. Little tiny specks in the distance. I saw a flash over at 11 o'clock. At least I think that was a flash. You've seen flashes. <laughs> Krabby saw a superhero, everybody. got lost at where I was in the cockpit for a second. I looked to the left at the wing, looked, turned to look at the map, and I looked to the wing and I went, ah, the plane's the wrong way around. <laughs> 
Not seeing too much more tracer from the front. If any, for a little while. Yeah, a little early to call it a milk run. <laughs> Heading has been very steady. I see the German tracer. Yeah. For some reason I do as well. That's right. Was removed in single player. It might be a multiplayer thing. Yeah, possibly. Next waypoint is scheduled for 18.34, but we arrived a minute early on the last waypoint, so 18.33, which means 28 minutes left. Watch out. 28 minutes of bloody night fighters to try and get through. I wonder what they did all day on the B-29 missions. Play cards or something? Yeah, they must have. <laughs> like 2,400 kilometers from Saipan to South Japan. <laughs> one way. Yeah. Well, that's a fun mission we could do. <laughs> that's a negative. <laughs> Don't think there's a map big enough for that, is there? Not at all. See, that's why I'm excited for a little project that came out a while ago called Titan IM. <laughs> because that has the whole world mapped into a game and it's for military simulation. So I'm thinking World War II mods. Uh... <laughs> IL-2 is limited to like 1000 by 1000. And even La Chute, which has 1100 something kilometers, I think, or at least a little bit over a thousand. You can't save missions in the FMB with objects that are more east than a thousand kilometers. Yeah. You can when you edit the mission manually, though. I tested that before. Oh. I had like, I did like a, a night bombing mission on Slovakia because it had like the populated towns. Yeah. But because the map is so small, I had to let the bombers fly out of map. Yeah. So, so you just would set one coordinate to like minus a hundred thousand so they would like fly on for a hundred kilometers out of the map <laughs> that does work that looks janky though as hell <laughs> yeah, later I changed to Bessarabia and then when I had better mods obviously North Sea or RLV Night and now La Shoot hmm. as soon as I discovered La Shoot existed like I'll to instantly became my favorite flight sim. <laughs> it was like, yes, big missions, thank you. How big a map do you want? And our answer is, yes! <laughs> Are we still going 255 MPH? Yeah, just under. Roger that. We bomb us at 4 to 5 o'clock. We are in the middle. Up. I'm gonna decline a little bit. Decline? Don't you mean descent? Decline. <laughs> 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 
I decline this altitude. I decline this height. <laughs> <laughs> Flying my instruments is like, it's alright, but I keep looking at the cockpit and I look back down and everything seems to have changed. <laughs> um, I posted this video on the ACG um, Discord and the, um, Elos from STAB unit was like, oh yeah, we're going to fly HE-111s, which I've already been told. And I was just like, hmm, I'm still very tempted. <laughs> I like bombers a lot. You don't say. Search lights, one o'clock. Now, if you hadn't made that bomber mission, we would have never been friends, right? Married, I mean, married, married. married. <laughs> 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 Depending on how popular a video becomes, there are potentially like a million viewers. I, w I wonder how many people will believe that we're married. Some people without a sarcasm filter, maybe. <laughs> Which, to be honest, is the internet. It could be quite possible, couldn't it? Yeah. Oh shit. There's another flash! What are these flashing? Well, I'm not flashing anything. Not guilty, Your Honor. <laughs> Doubt. We're still going. The usual constant battle behind us, but nothing here. Uh, nothing in front either. Still searchlights one. Of course, here. We're doing another engine that's not. Doesn't Flags, sound, rear clock. Doesn't sound English. Definitely bombs around that's not shooting at us. Oh yeah, see flak. Current heading one zero zero. Yeah, we've gone a bit off course a little bit. Yeah, I see friendly bombers to our right there being lit up.
Back on course. You seem to have a hand to navigate us around flag. Yes. All on purpose, of course. Of course. <laughs> I'd much rather be lucky than good. Naturally. That's what I say whenever I go golfing, which is never, which is why I'd much rather be lucky. Because <laughs> I'm not going to be good. Uh, yeah, Tracer, one o'clock. Oh, Night Fighter shooting five o'clock level. Close. Like three kilometers. Not behind the cloud, can't see anything. Lots of trace fire up ahead. All bridges so far. That's what I was going to ask you. Fishy, how about, how do you, do you fancy a trip to England? <laughs> Before the Brexit? Before the Brexit. Well, it's, it's too late, I think. Too late? <laughs> I, I mean, did they change the laws already? Did, like, I by the way, think so. current heading 105? Yeah, 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 I'm just trying to get us back in the stream a little bit. Actually, I kind of thought about that. Bomber going down 9 o'clock. Uh, 3 o'clock, sorry. Oh yeah, Tracer, that's pretty close. Switching back 095. Seems like everyone's to the right of us. You were going like a little bit too much to the south, so you already corrected against it, I guess. We were for for a while at uh, one or five and stuff. Yeah. Money wise, it I think it would not be a problem. For yeah. how much euros do you reckon could I like drive with the train or something? Oh. Another bomber shot down, 3 o'clock. Oh boy. I am unsure. The Eurotrain is kind of expensive. Uh, not expensive as flying, I guess, but... It's just that I'm probably going to go to Duxford this year. Which is near Stansted, close enough. Stansted Airport. Um, I'm originally going there to meet up with the ACG guys, but I'm also going to bring my dad, and if you want to stare at old planes with me, then you can. <laughs> oh Jesus, and another night fighter engaging, and another bomber going down. I'll have my eyes open. Yes, please. Well, spending time with the ACG guys and you and your dad sounds awesome. <laughs> But honestly, I've never traveled afar alone before. Yeah. Probably would want to bring a friend or so.
Let's keep our eyes out for these fires. Okay, there were three bombers going down in the last minutes, so I'm uh, on the edge of my seat a bit. We're very much going to be next. <laughs> Climbing a little bit. Next waypoint, 13 minutes. Current heading zero nine zero. Yeah. Moon's up. I'm at zero nine five again. Maybe, just maybe, I could get a robot to travel with me. Ooh. Yeah, it'd be a weekend thing as well. It's um, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. But a shared double room a night is £60. But it comes with food in the morning and stuff. Okay. But I'm also like, it's really hard for me to decide whether I want to go. Because... It, it might get to the point where I have to choose going to Duxford and seeing ACG guys and you if you wanted to come over, or going to Le Mans. <laughs> <laughs> so it's a very hard decision. Le Mans see the race. It's the classics though, it's not the race race. Okay. But still. Them all. <laughs> More people under attack. I don't see any planes next to us anymore that were there previously. I do see some. 092 right now. Going a little bit north. The last minutes. I got down the wrong way. I keep thinking I hear another aircraft engine, and I think I'm paranoid. I need someone to show me the things in life that I can find. <laughs> zero nine zero again. God damn it! Just fucking trim out, you bastard! Do anything in the planes like that. Nope. Going this way for a little bit. Roger. Two nine five currently, so that's the way. I think you need to rudder trim a, lit a little bit to the right or something. Yeah, as soon as I do that, everything else goes out of whack, so then I have to basically just start again. Just, uh... Yeah, we're still going a little bit too far. No, it's, it's still 94 and... That is too far right because I pressed it one little time. Uh. <laughs> and if anyone in the comments is like, oh, it's really easy to fly, I'm gonna punch them in the face. <laughs> Through the internet cable? Yeah. Like you open your win your YouTube window and just one. That's how, fist that is how it works, out of yeah. Window, uh, <laughs> out of your screen. Pong. Pong. 
we'll see me chase the front for a little bit. I'm concentrating on watching the black in the rear and uh, I don't see anything either concerned. <laughs> Fly straight, damn it! It's so, so, so dark. <laughs> Maybe we should correct 100 for a few minutes. Dipped a little to the left again there for... A uh, I see a wreck coming onto our nose now. But, uh, How far off do you reckon we are? Uh, Tracer, one o'clock. Five minutes to waypoint. Which translates into 33.8 kilometers. I feel like we're quite far away off now. It's so hard to fly an aircraft that won't trim. <laughs> You just like every kind of little bit where you think it's going okay, you like don't look at the instruments for like a minute and you're like five kilometers off. Say go back to zero nine five where it's, we were at one oh seven or so. Yeah. And I just I can't tell how far off course we are. I really can't. Not really. We are pretty much on course. Nice. Wings level. I can see the river ends in CM04 of our 3 o'clock. Nice.
So another flash at one, uh, one o'clock. Really surprised we haven't died yet. <laughs> Marker flares one o'clock. No eyes. Correct to one o five, please. Watch out. Little bit more to one one zero, please. see these flares at all. Are they close? I see a wreck. Yeah, yeah, I already... The flares are like two kilometers south of those, so to the right from your position. Right. They are already... I have to, to, um, to aim low with the front guns to see them. Oh, I see. They might have just been lit up because I think we were supposed to be here at uh, 34 and it's uh, 32 only. And since we are in the front of the bomber stream, if we are early, the window in between the mosquitoes and us arriving is pretty small. Uh, <laughs> Brain won't English sometimes, you know. <laughs> and I'm not a German spy or anything. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Tracer, 12. We're quite a far distance ahead. So you weren't too far off then. And we actually were off north a bit. A bit. Do we go and bomb after this one, don't we? Roger that. Or rather, affirmative. Start saying Victor and I'll start getting really confused. Actually, if we turn in 50 seconds, we are right on time. Roger. See, I'm just flying like I should be. <laughs> I know, Krabby had all planned. <laughs> the great master plan has been executed. Mm. I only came up with the plane, like... Plane? Oh no. <laughs> Okay, turn to zero zero five, please. Zero zero five. Order that navigator.
There we go. Current heading 357. Yeah. I'm trying to correct it, but I can't see a fucking thing. <laughs> Bomb doors open in five minutes. Roger. I'm flying purely by instruments now. There's a big ass cloud in front of me, which means I can't see the horizon. Waypoint flares being dropped behind us. Roger. Oh, hello, Mr. Cloud. Yeah. Quite a big one. Just saw more traces to my 12. And we're out the other side. Say hello from the other side. <laughs> oh, tracer, uh, 3 o'clock. Cowalt. Visual. And 12. I can't tell if I'm hearing sirens or imagining it. I think I'm just imagining it. I don't think you can hear them from up here. Yeah, no, I didn't think I could. Current heading 011. Yeah, we just drifted a bit off to the uh, east. I don't know which way that is. <laughs> I'm just correcting a little bit. That Lancaster is still firing a crap load. Yeah, I saw the night fighter for a second there. I always see him. Ju88. Who's winning? Looks like the Lancaster cause the 88 is uh, not really engaging, just goofing around. Green flares front, 12 o'clock level. That are the target flares. Roger. Up. There's a bomber right in front of the flares. Yeah, I can see it, I just saw it move off. Yeah. 
That was pretty cool, actually. <laughs> So just aim for the flares. That's where the city is. Green flares are the target marker flares, that's your aim point. Tracer at 12. I think we're just skimming across the cloud here. I see searchlights ahead, but I don't see the green. Green 12 o'clock. Yeah, I'm trying to see it from the bombardier's position. Bomb doors open. Can have a look through the bomb site. Uh, scene. Gonna adjust. Slide to the left. Are you at eight five o'clock low close? Roger. Keep an eye on him, would you? Yep. Why can't I see the green through the bomb site? They're just a little bit more to the left. Should be off twelve o'clock. Lights. We are lit up. Right, get ready to bombs away, chaps. Shit. Right. I think around now. Maybe. What do you reckon? Fuck it. Go! Bombs away. Bombs gone. And keep steady until the splash. Orders are orders. Flag opening up. On us. Shit. Uh, only a few seconds until the base effects. Uh, just a bit to the left side of the of the green. Roger. That's fine. Bomb doors closed. Bomb doors closed. And new co heading is three three three. Let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Roger that. <laughs> On target, 1844. Ah! We switched the only for one minute. I went too far. Shit, I'm trying to evade a little bit. The flak is really heavy. Yep, just evade uh, however you want. Gonna get out of here. Like, Gotta get super here. heavy! <laughs> oh my god! Uh, I don't mind if you want to match altitude as well. Yeah, I'm going up and down. Fuck! Give it all you got. The flak Mind ahead is insane.
Night Fighter 5 o'clock. Ah, oh, bollocks. Stop! Line me up! Shit, Tracer close off the right wing. Roger. New heading 265. Roger, 265. Still being bloody lit up here. We seem to be doing okay. Haven't been hit anyway. Then we have one little shrapnel hit. They didn't do anything. All Gucci. Oh, they're still trying to fire at us, though. Uh, lots of gunfire off our left wing and to our 12. Okay. There's a night fighter at 6 o'clock, but he's engaging a different Lancaster. <laughs> I was almost, I almost started corkscrewing then. Now that's gonna sound different. That's gonna sound like hitting the shit panic button. <laughs> yep. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Right, that was really, really fucking, fucking scary. More green flares have been dropped behind us. Affirmative. Okay, current recording is 62 minutes, 45 seconds, let's keep it running until the green marker flares are out of render distance. Roger, a lot of green, a lot of tracer just fired from in front of us pretty close. Lots of tracer over to our left wing. Two loads of it. Ready to refresh? Yep. One, two, three. And we're on. Okay. Lights for a second, please. Three, two, one, on. Off. Right, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I really wouldn't know how to synchronize this otherwise, you know. <laughs> We're going straight for a half an hour. <laughs> oh, burning Lancaster, five o'clock. There's always stuff happening behind me. 
Current heading 257. Oh, I'm getting the wrong way again. Two six five right on track. Next waypoint scheduled for 1919, that is in 39 minutes. Uh, yeah. Never mind. 19 minutes. Never mind. 29 minutes. Fuck's sake. No, we got it. 29. <laughs> <laughs> Over. About 260, I can power down a little bit. Enemy night fighter, 7 o'clock. Roger. Keep me posted on him. I think he's following us. Oh shit. I'll yell at you when you yep. to evade. <laughs> if uh, if he's having on us, I want to hear machine guns chattering away. <laughs> Roger that. Like yeah. Current heading 273. Yeah, changing it back. Going into a cloud. Rip. That might shake him off actually. Still on us. How far away is he? Two kilometers. Oh boy, not, not too long then. He can't uh, seem to get his bearings quite yet. But he knows we're near here. <laughs> He's still maneuvering around. Not on final approach. Oh. Well. Well. Wait for it. Cox crew now. Uh. He's coming. Uh. Keep maneuvering. I'm still going. Shit. Don't turn it on top, you motherfucker. What? You're getting shot at. He broke off. He broke off. Did you just maneuver left, right, or were we on top? Like, uh. We went over, yeah, we barreled. <laughs> Why the fuck would you do that? I spilled all my coffee. <laughs> he current heading 295. Oh. Holy shit, Gravy, it happened. I heard we got hit a little bit. <laughs> okay. I saw him at 1 o'clock, but when I changed to the front, everything's black. I saw Tracer go over our heads. Yeah, yeah, you fired for a second. Current heading 325. Roger. Left turn. Attention. 
1955 Night Fighter Attack. <laughs> Yeah, we've been over the target already, we've just been attacked. Ugh. Hello, Zerxo. Now we've got to climb again. <laughs> we lost like a thousand feet doing that. Or more, we lost about two thousand feet doing that maneuver. <laughs> Yeah, but it's way better than dying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, much. How are the burns on your legs? <laughs> I'm good. Was that you firing it, was it, Adam? Yeah. I have a feeling our bad luck is about to happen. <laughs> but <I'm> <laughs> we made it. We made it out alive. We have been on this course for 10 minutes now. 67 kilometers round about. More searchlights. Eleven low. I mean, of course. Yeah, as usual, searchlights are low. I know. <laughs> 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 and I'm gonna eject. <laughs> I did the same error with tanks and, and uh, ships before. Enemy destroyer, 12 o'clock low. <laughs> yeah, the enemy does not have flying ships yet. No, no, no more night fighters. No more around us. Nothing. <laughs> I got visual on exactly nothing. Nice. Apart from lots of searchlights. Where they come from? Back at seventeen thousand feet. Still climbing. Moon's doing its weird thing again. But I can see inside the cockpit now, probably. Which is nice. Yeah. And of course, I did not sp uh, spill my coffee, but my tea. Just <laughs> British, and I'm definitely not a German spy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are being lit up by. Where well, are we? Yeah. Dodge light. Are we? Evasive action. Are we? Yeah, all white for me. It doesn't look the same. I don't think we are. Maybe just for me. So it's, not, it's not on the wings. It's not in the cockpit. Well, as long as we're not being shot by a flag anyway. Yeah. That's a Light at us. On the other hand, we might be visible to night fighters like this. I don't think I don't think we're lit up at all. The wings aren't or anything. Yeah, it's gone now, but we were definitely. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's the moon. <laughs> no, 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 we were. My cock, my rear gun, gunner station was all uh, white. Ah. We're normally back up at alt.
19 minutes to waypoint. Nice. We might be a slight delayed because of the evasive action and climb after that. Yeah. I think I hear more than our engines. That's not the first time I heard that today. Flying, flying, flying. I can't make out any Tahan features like this. Tahan? Oh, never mind, there is a. There's a river, river to the left, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we can spot our stuff on the left hand side because the moon is doing some good, good work. Keep it up, moon! Keep it up, moon! Good job, lad! All nice and round. Mm. Curvaceous. 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 <laughs> Would a real Lancaster be able to do a barrel roll? Yes. Easy because easy. you just decided so? I can't remember who it was, but the, the, the test pilot, I can't remember his name, who did, um, he flew with, like the German aircraft, and like flew like the most amount of aircraft ever, I think it's that guy, I can't remember, I fucking, why can't I remember his name, it's Willie something. Um, but he was, he was flying a Lancaster, and he basically went to this guy, watch this, and did a, and did a roll. <laughs> <laughs> okay then. Then your actions are absolutely uh, rectified. Oh god, yeah, this thing flies like a kite. It's really easy to lose orientation like that. I was in the rear gun firing and then, like, um, where's <laughs> this guy gone? <laughs> you gotta do what you gotta do to survive. <laughs> Miraculous that we made it through that flag nearly completely unscathed. Yeah, one tiny little hit and then I think a scrape with a bullet. We got pretty fucking lucky. <laughs> I don't th see anything coming from the wings. We're Gucci. Yeah, I see nothing to our front, no tracer. There are tracers in the back, as always. As always. Trim is working correctly. <laughs> A 
Estimated current position, Charlie Delta U7. Roger that. We're close to waypoint 9. Affirmative. I like having a map. <laughs> you have to make a map together for a uh, uh, Helen back other one. <laughs> uh, Helen back other one, yeah. Yeah, did you notice that we filmed to Helen back 5 before we filmed to Helen back 4? Yes. And I'm so it would probably just be easy to rename them, but I guess I'm just gonna uh, upload 5 first, easy peasy. Yeah. Nobody will be confused or anything. No. Nope. Just nope. to Helen back, British edition. Electric Boogaloo. <laughs> Electric a Boogaloo? Electric Boogaloo. Uh-huh. <laughs> okay, I gotta say, nice move. Uh, Nice evasive action there, Chuck Jaeger. Thank you. <laughs> I can foresee being in Vietnam in a few years. <laughs> Electric funnel, <laughs> yes. <laughs> a funeral <laughs> funnel. And, and, when, and when Tony was like joking about him, I, I went like, Google, ah, oh, he's still alive. <laughs> <laughs> I think that man can not die. Yeah, that might be the case. Imagine doing that much combat and dying naturally, shaking my head. <laughs> Way to go. I haven't seen any traces to the front for a little while. Roger that. <sighs> Can you make out any landmarks to the south? South to the left or to the right? <laughs> left. There. Mm, no. <laughs> uh, mm, no. <laughs> no. Not at all. I thought I saw something, but it was my screen. Like the, the windscreen. Roger. It looked like a river, and I was like, ah, something. But alas, it was not something. Ah, I can see a river. North. That river bend should be characteristic. Let me get, let me see. Search lights. Ten o'clock. Well, never mind, can't tell. I'm hearing different engines. We still are very well in Night Fighter land. Twice at seven o'clock, as I as I said that. <laughs> Sounds like something is over to the left wing, below us. I think we're lit up, boys.
Yup. Completely in my face. <laughs> Ow! My eyes! <laughs> ah, fuck. That was really bright. Ah, I see where we are. Where are we? I'm still... I'm hearing a, something get closer. Fishy. Yeah, Charlie Delta 29. I have my eyes open, don't worry. No flak though. Twenty eleven. Right, we're out of uh searchlight. The problem is always when I mark something on the map, my eyes kind of have to adjust to the darkness again. Yeah. I like the idea as well that it's the red, red flashlight thing. Yeah. Oh, Tracer, 11 o'clock. Roger. Going through a cloud. 17,400 I wish there was a sound effect that made my voice sound British <laughs> It's called voice actors <laughs> Hey, I'm see, I just saw flak yeah, seeing flak uh, 10 o'clock lower over the searchlights. For me, we are lit up again. One is lighting at me. It's fine. Well, that's that taken care of. Say again? That's that taken care of. Back in course 265, or thereabouts. Yep. Dropping a little bit as well. 17,200 feet. Going through a large cloud. Turn is scheduled in four minutes. Watch out. It's 
It's cl this is a big cloud. I will admit. I haven't seen another bomber for a while. Me neither. Still traces 7 o'clock way in the distance though. He's Irish. <laughs> I'm clearly Irish since I'm not a German spy. <laughs> New heading 270. Roger, 270. Also barely a turn, but hey. Yeah. Here we go.
I don't think there's anyone alive left in front of us, to be honest. <laughs> Stop crying. <laughs> Everyone's feckin' dead. <laughs> We've only made it to waypoint nine. <laughs> I completely forgot to restart your TeamSpeak recording. Oh no. It's only going to be saved in a different format. I'll have to convert it somehow. That'll be fine. Desperately trying out to make out some land features, but I can't see shit. I can't see fucking anything. <laughs> some river to the south. Fighters. Fighters. I heard a call out for fighters.
I see a river out the left window. Two of them, in fact. Two of them? Yeah, one pretty close, kinking up and then back down towards us, and the other one uh, heads off into the distance, heads off south. Trace us five o'clock pretty close. Um, can you make out which river that is? I can't move the map, so I. No. Why can't you move the map? Because I've ruined something in my controls and now I can't use it. Good job. Thank you. Yeah, my middle mouse, my middle mouse, um, my wheel doesn't work, so I can't zoom in and out, which is really frustrating. And I tried to look at how to change it back, and I couldn't find the option. Okay. Or at least didn't know what the option was. Lots of tracers close behind us, 7 o'clock. Oh no. Multiple night fighters here, I think. Oh, I could hear it. That wasn't ours. Awesome. Some contact. 8 o'clock low. Watch out. I assume the river we're going over is at uh, BR. B what? BR? BR, whatever line we're on. BR, okay. Would fit pretty nicely with my calculation. Yeah. Please let us live. <laughs> Like little water bits around it. I would say we are at the O, but it, uh, it's only a few kilometers off. Dutch lights. We are yeah. being lit up. Shit. Please no. Ow! <laughs> My eyes! I was tapped out on the map and I thought we were hit when you yelled ow. I think there are like five, five searchlights are staring at us. Ow! We yeah, got hit. shooting at us as well. Shit. All I want to do is go home for tea. Oh, Jesus. Although, being lit up, I can tell where we are, and I think you're where you said we are is right. <laughs> it seems like the, the, the town, right, Rotterdam? Yeah. I suggest 
sudden changes in altitude. Yes, I, I noticed that I've gone very high up, so I'm going to go very far down. Very speed. Oh, that flag was very close in front of us. Night fighter, five o'clock. Close? Yeah. It's coming Take for us. Action. Take it, action. Ah. He's coming in. Turn left, turn left if you can. Turn left. Turn it left. Oh, oh shit, I see him. I'm just shooting somewhere. I see him. He's shooting at us. Shit. Ah. Fuck! We're on fire! Oh, what is burning? Fuel tank on fire. Bail, bail, bail! Shit! Hello, darkness, my, my old, old friend. friend. <laughs> I come to talk with you again. Don't do anything, keep everything running. Yeah, they are still shooting at us, because that's necessary. Someone's still aboard. <laughs> Attention! Be dead. <laughs> okay, I guess I'll keep the mission running until we crashed. <laughs> hey, that's awesome for the video. Nobody will think that we get shot down after three hours and 45 minutes. Yeah. Or two hours, 45 minutes. Are you happy with that? Because I'm pretty happy I'm, with that. <laughs> I'm, pr I'm pretty happy with this result. We had all kind. Of, we, we saw uh, bombers getting shot down around us. Got shot by flag a lot, searchlights, and attacked by night fighters two times. <laughs> Feels like a shame. Every time I get in a bomber, we never make it back. <laughs> <laughs> and that's actually untrue. We made it back yesterday. <laughs> Why did I die? Did you die? I died! <laughs> there was someone still in that Lancaster as it was going down. Do you think it was you? Huh. Okay, um, did the plane crash yet? I have no idea. I can't see it. <laughs> This is definitely worth a video. Yes. <laughs> but, but but I'd like to, if you are really willing, I would like to reapply this at some point. Yes, definitely. Make, so we, <laughs> that we can survive it. Because <laughs> it's definitely really good condition right now. The flak hit us. The night fighters hit us. Yep. Oh, it's, engine on fire. Fuel tank on fire. Fuel tank on fire. I'm, gu I'm guessing it crashed now. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> that was awesome. That was fucking awesome. We were successfully shot down! Yeah! Mission making succeeded! <laughs> okay, before you go anywhere this time, and before you disconnect, I need to end the mission on the other PC, and then we will have to gather our replays. Yes. Be right back. I'm just here gently floating down. <laughs> Good night, Robert.
I hope everyone enjoyed it. Well, it's a long one again, but that should be a video now. And we'll do it again. See if we can get back. Because it's more of a challenge than what it was yesterday. Yesterday was kind of like, um, it was pretty easy to get back. This time it felt like we had a bit more of a challenge. So, we'll have another go at that in the future, but it won't be like another month, until another month or so. So, let me know what you think in the comments and stuff, and um, I'll see you next time. And bye-bye.